Hello and welcome to the second episode of the next 100 seconds. All right, so we're all in this together and we're all feeling a lot of things. Now back in the 1980s, Elizabeth Kubler-Ross published a book called On Death and Dying in which she identified the five stages that we go through as we encounter something as big and as encompassing as death. She said, first, there's denial. We don't want to believe it. Then there's anger. We get quite upset because this is our fate. Then there's bargaining. We really try to figure out how we can have a little bit more time or if we do this or if we did that. Then there's depression where it just sort of settles in that this is going to happen. And that finally leads to acceptance. And really, all of us right now, because of what's going on in the world, are in different parts of this different stages of this. And I think it's really important for us to understand that so that we can know that if we wake up and we don't want to believe the news we're seeing out of the world, or if we're just going to get angry about that, or the flip side of anger is fear. If we just get frozen and really worried about what's about to happen to us, all of that is okay. And if we're going to do things to keep us super busy, because we know if we try to do this, we might stay healthy, or our family might stay healthy, or someone might not get infected, that's bargaining. That's okay too. And then we might just wake up one morning and go, oh my God, this is horrible. It's never going to be better. That's depression. And we have to admit that all of us, all of the time, are going to be feeling some mixture of these things because this is traumatic. This is going to be one of the most traumatic things that's ever happened to us. And the only way we can encounter this is together and by taking care of each other together, we can get to acceptance.